we need to keep in mind that Penn State isn't the only institution vulnerable to sports scandals. As this map indicates, it could happen anywhere, and often does. The map shows scandals involving major college football programs that have occurred since the year 2000. A University of Miami booster gave players millions of dollars worth of gifts, including cash and prostitutes, for almost a decade beginning in 2002. At USC, Reggie Bush received improper benefits, resulting in his being ordered to return his 2005 Heisman Trophy. Florida State was forced to forfeit 12 wins from the 2006-2007 season because of academic cheating. Most of the other scandals listed here involved improper benefits in some form or another, and some of them much more minor. When a program is great, there is pressure to keep it great. That sort of pressure, if left unsupervised, can result in various levels of cheating and impropriety. Therefore, any institution with a big-time sports program needs to stay vigilant about compliance issues. Of course, the Penn State scandal was quite different. There were never any allegations of wrongdoing with respect to NCAA regulations. As mentioned before, Joe Paterno was well known as a stickler for the rules and valued his players' achievements in the classroom as much as on the field. Even with this reputation, or perhaps because of it, the suggestion of impropriety in the way its members handled the allegations against Sandusky was enough to tarnish the entire program, and by extension, the entire institution. <laughs> 